to the channel I know it's been a minute say hi to Alexis if you guys couldn't guess we are in labor <laughs> um, our water broke well our water broke my water broke <clears throat> my water broke ab about 750 I was on my way to a doctor's appointment so I just got out the shower and <laughs> I'm sitting there oh I'm sitting there on the bed and I just felt like a big gush, huge gush of water. And I'm like, oh my God. <laughs> and then I'm like, babe, my water broke. And he's like, what? What? And I was like, yeah, my water broke. I thought and I I'm heard just dripping wrong. everywhere. And I'm like, oh my God, I'm sorry. Like, I'm making a mess. And I'm leaving like a trail of water everywhere. <laughs> but yeah. Yeah, this is baby girl's vitals. You guys kind of, oh, yeah. there we go. 137 hearts beats per minute. Did you tell them the day? Huh? Tell oh, yes. Today is January, January, July 27th. The due date is August 5th, but, you know. Oh, also, guys, they were supposed, they were going to induce me yes. on Wednesday because apparently I had, like, some extra fluid. So they were planning to induce me, and I was kind of sad about it. I didn't want to be induced, so we're kind of happy that my water broke and that everything's going to be hopefully progressively naturally. Mm -hmm. So we're excited. Yes, and in the beginning, my guess for the due date of the baby was July 26th. It's not July 26th, but it's close enough, you know? <laughs> Uh, so what I happened? am, what did she say, two centimeters? Yes, she is two centimeters dilated. I don't know, dilated. she said uh, two maybe two centimeters and 70% efface. So. What does efface mean? I don't know. I think it's when your cervix is, is thinning out. Okay. And you have to get to 100. Uh, Guys, look it. It looks like she just came out of a water why park. Why are you showing that? <laughs> Babe. Well, it's, it's a part of life. It was so much, and I was dripping everywhere, and I'm like, it, it was just, it's a lot. But I'm kind of having my water broke. That's the experience I wanted to have instead of, like, the contractions and timing them and stuff. So I'm kind of happy, but I'm also kind of embarrassed. I'm like, oh my Why God. are you embarrassed? That's not, that's what I don't get. It's just everywhere. I don't get it, guys. She's embarrassed. She, her water breaks. We're having a conversation <laughs> in bed, right? And we're talking, talking. Because my mom was supposed to get me to take me to the doctor. Yeah, so I'm going to tell them the story from the okay. beginning. So yesterday, we went to my brother's house. We were chilling. Uh, I don't know. T yesterday, I was just so tired. And I couldn't, like, I just couldn't keep my eyes open yesterday. So we got home. She falls asleep on the couch. And then I go to my room, and I'm, I'm watching, like, this anime. And I'm like, I'm just so tired. And bear in mind, guys, some more of my mucus plug has been falling out, like, sl like, like slowly. Yeah, every day this week, she's a piece of her mucus plug is just coming out. So, guys, sorry. The, what is it? The tech came in. The nurse came in. As I was saying, so, yesterday, I was just feeling tired. So, after my anime finished, I went to the living room. She's in the living room. So, I was like, I'll go chill in the living room. And I fall asleep like right away. And this is the longest I've slept in maybe two weeks, yeah, three we weeks. I sleep at I fell asleep from what, 12, 12 30 to like 7 30 this morning. And mind you, she takes a shower, she comes she comes back into the room and she we're just talking and it's like what, seven what? Seven forty five. Right? So seven forty five, seven fifty. Nah, seven fifty my water broke. So, okay. Like five minutes before. So, we're talking. I'm like, babe, I don't want to call. She was like, I don't want to go to the, this appointment. But, you know, she has to. And then out of nowhere, she goes, my water broke. I said, what? Because I thought I heard her wrong. Oh, my God. Like, I'm peeing myself. <laughs> she thought she was peeing herself. Like, but then, while, while, the, I can't 
Bro, it was just coming out. Like, I'm not peeing myself. Well, while this happened, she was, I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry. I'm like, why are you sorry? It's, it's, it's natural. You're going to get it anywhere you at, you're going to get it there. So it, she wet the bed. That's it. That's fine. <laughs> wow. But it was like, it was like it was so much. I wasn't expecting it to be so much. And, still, when I'm on the and way here, yes, it, it was leaking while she was on the way here. And then it stopped for a little bit. And then once we got into this room, yeah. But once we got into this room, it started leaking again, and that's why it looks like a water park in here. <laughs> Um, anything else? But I'll keep you guys updated. Next clip will maybe be me. I don't know. They said we're going to be in this room for most, probably most yes, of the day. Yes, probably most of the day. They're going to give us updates on how many centimeters she is. And then once we get into the other room, that's probably when we'll update you guys. All right. This is... What up, guys? Welcome back. Um, it's been around seven, eight hours since we... First got here, um, a lot has gone on. Um, I'm gonna let Alexis tell you everything that's gone on because she wrote everything down. Hey guys, so um, since we last talked to you guys, oh sorry, it's taking my blood pressure. Since we last talked to you guys, um, first they swabbed me for COVID. So they swabbed me for COVID and they they didn't swab Tyler. They're not doing the support person anymore. Which I find interesting. But yeah, so they saw me for COVID. Then they told me I could have an epidural if I wanted to. So I wanted to wait a little bit. I we waited till like around two o'clock to let them know that I wanted an epidural. And then by two thirty I got the epidural. So that feels nice. <laughs> I wasn't having like too bad of like cramping. I mean too bad of contractions. So I mean I'm I now I just feel even better. It made me feel so relaxed. And then after that, they give me, like, the catheter because they obviously don't want you to get up out of bed and stuff after that. So, I got that around, like, 3, 320. And then, after that, we had, like, a little scare. I don't know if Tyler wants to help me yeah. out with that. So, after they put the catheter in and all that, we decided to take a nap because since we can, we have a few hours on our hands. So, we took a nap. And then out of nowhere, the nurse, one of the nurse comes in. I'm still sleeping. Yeah, so uh, she, like, rushes. She comes in, and she seemed kind of frazzled. So I'm like, okay, like, whatever. I'm like, whatever. So then she comes in, then one, another one comes in. And then, like, two more come in. And then I feel like the whole department comes in after that. And everybody's just, like, working on me, touching me, like. And then they're like, oh, I'm, sh I'm like, is she okay? Is she okay? And they're like, well, she she's fall she's fallen. I think that's, she's like, what the. Or yeah, like she's that. falling. And I'm like, in my head, I'm like, what, do you do? what does that we mean? Thought, we thought she was giving falling birth. Falling out of me. Like, what do you mean she's falling? And then they're like, her heartbeat is falling. So then they, like, um, rush to put the. Oh my gosh. <laughs> her, that's her heartbeat. And every time it stops, we get so scared now. Um, they rush to put in the little, what is it, a monitor on her head to monitor her heartbeat. Uh huh. Because. It just dropped, and then, uh, whatever. It was so scary. It was probably the worst thing ever. Like, in the moment, I just got through it and let them do whatever. But after, I, like, I had a little bit of, like, a breakdown. Because I'm like, that was so scary. Yeah. It was just, like, I woke up, and yeah, I didn't I know where like, the hell I was for a second. I was, like, I was, I looked at Tyler, and I'm, like, trying to call him. But I, the words couldn't come out of my mouth. It's like, and then he woke up and he saw everybody in there. He's like, "What the hell?" And he's just like, oh "There was at there was at least ten people, in ten the people in there." And I was like, "What the hell is going on? Did I miss something?" Yeah, it was. Uh, for a second, I thought the baby already came, <laughs> but we was in the living room, and plus, I was in the most uncomfortable um, setup ever. I had like two chairs and a stool. I don't even know how. But now, I'm about to show you guys a little tour yeah, of the so like, delivery room. At around 5, at 5 o'clock, we, we came in the room. They put us in the delivery room, and I guess Tyler's going to show you a little tour of yeah. that. I'll show you guys a little tour right now. So, when we first come in, we have this, uh, I think it's like an incubator. 
for the baby when she's born. All right, we have some of the monitors. This is where her heartbeat is, guys. Yeah, that's the scare we had was with her heartbeat. Uh, this is right here. This is uh, her IV, her epidural. I don't know what this is to be honest with you. We have Alexis. Hey, Hello. I look horrible, but it's okay. You look like you're about to give birth. That's it. <laughs> then we have over here. Oh, you didn't show me a I'm gonna get to it. That's the last part. Oh, we got the couch. It's not that comfortable, to be honest with you. It's like, it's kind of hard. But it's there. It I think it turns into a bed. But I'm not too sure. Nope, it doesn't. They lied to us. <laughs> My mom told me that. We have a table. I was eating some spankies. I don't know what they are. It's okay. I some I need to be at full strength, honey. Full no, strength. He's so sweet. He was like, "If you don't want me to eat, I won't eat." And I'm like, "Babe, you have to eat." He's like, "No, forget it. I don't want food anymore." I'm like, "You have to eat." But he was being really sweet. I mean, I'm not gonna. I don't want to just eat and just like she get jealous, you know. <laughs> we have the bathroom. Uh, nice little bathroom. What's up, guys? Uh, the shower, you know. When you sit down, you can sit down and shower. The toilet. <laughs> I hope so. <laughs> Alright, and then where I'll probably be sleeping tonight if it goes on all night. Well, we're, we're going to be here anyway. So, yeah, I'm only up to this me. is my reclining chair. It's awesome. It's very comfortable. I'm about to sit back down because my back is hurting. I'm only up to three centimeters, by the way. Yes, three, three centimeters, centimeters. At 612. So, I mean, we, we, I think I've been out of three for like about three uh, hours. No, you've been out of three for a good like hour hours. and a half, two hours. Two hours? Mm hmm. But it's moving on quick. quick. We're already three centimeters and we've only been here eight hours. Right? Eight hours? I don't, it, honestly, it time doesn't is feel. flying by. It doesn't feel like we've been here that doesn't, long. Uh, it doesn't feel like we've been here for that long. Like, we woke up. We told you the story of how everything happened. <laughs> but, yeah, time is moving up. It's moving real fast. quick. And we just want her in our arms. Yes. At this point. I'm just over I'm not over it, but I just... Well, after that scare, you just... I just yeah, you don't. We don't want to see that again. Like the next time they they all come in like that, I want the baby to be here. Yeah, like I thought they were gonna be like, we're gonna have to do emergency C section. Like I was, that's what I was. I thought they were gonna be like, oh, you're ten centimeters already. I don't know how, but you're ten centimeters. I'm like, what's wrong? And and they weren't really saying anything at first. I'm like, is she okay? What's wrong? What's wrong? And they were just like kind of silent, just doing their thing, you know. Well, not, they were talking to each other, but it was just scary, just scary, okay. scary. Oh wait, they don't know the name of the baby yet. <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna expose her name. Yeah. Well, guys, um, next time you see us, uh, we'll I don't know. We'll give you guys an update on how far, how many centimeters, and yeah, time we'll probably and be like closer to the delivery. Next time you see us. Alright guys. This is What up guys? Welcome back. It finally happened. Oh my god. This is the best day of my life. I'll tell you that much. My girlfriend is a freaking trooper. She is a freaking hero. Cause yo, she did that she handled that shit like a champ. I tell you that much. But let's, let me introduce you to the new addition. Say hi. <gasps> Look hi. at you. They haven't cleaned her up yet, but she's so beautiful. You want to say hi? She's so, like, she's looking around at everything. She's so alert. Is she? Mm-hmm. Yeah, baby girl. You want to say hi to the TNA Plus fan? She has hair too, guys. Yeah. 
Let's see if I can show you. I think I gave her a little cone head. That's okay. Okay. It's a big baby. <laughs> My baby girl is eight pounds, seven ounces. We had, we haven't found out her length yet. We'll let you guys know. But. Oh, man. It was a long night. No, it wasn't. It was, no, I'm not I'm finished what I was going to say. It was a long night, but for the labor part, the labor was, wasn't that bad. wasn't that bad. I just had a hard time towards the end. Towards the end, she started feeling more pain. I um, felt it's like, more uncomfortable, right? Yeah, like, I felt like my, <laughs> I don't know how to say this without being gross. I, like, had, I just felt like I had to poop, <laughs> and it's just a horrible feeling. Like, if you feel you have to poop and you can't poop, like... I don't know. You have you have that urge to push, and it wasn't time yet. It was only nine centimeters. Uh huh. But I think I complained to the point where they like, <laughs> were like, okay, you're ten centimeters. Yeah, she went from three centimeters at what time? Uh -huh. Were you three uh -huh. centimeters? Like four o'clock? I don't know. Four thirty. But it was like four thirty, and then I don't know, maybe three hours later, she was eight and a half centimeters, and then two, like literally. A minute later, not even, she was nine nine centimeters. So it was like, at the end, it just went like that, to be honest. Which I feel so blessed because we didn't have a extreme, oh, excuse me, extremely long labor. So I'm, I'm happy about it. It just looked like they had so many wires hooked up to her. Like, it just she looked gave uncomfortable. Us a scares. She gave us another scare after the last scare. Yeah, she gave us. A couple, but, but it was her just being a little attention seeker. Her being a little Leo. Uh, yep, being a little Leo. Yeah, her heart monitor was like messing up a bit, and gave us a little scare. But she's fine. Alexis is fine. I can't believe I did that, you guys. That's just it's amazing. like an amazing feeling. I mean, oh my god, I can't explain it. I Listen, I give you props, babe. Thank I give you. you props. I can't believe she was so. I, I thought she was gonna be like nine something, though. I was she's yeah. a little smaller than we expected. But good, good for me, good for me. All right, we're gonna see what else we have to do, but I think we're gonna end the video there. Um, um next video name reveal. Um, maybe we'll see. Okay. <laughs> next video, we'll let you guys know. We're back. Deuces.